Hello friends, welcome, namaskar. Let us take the concept of fixed cost. The cost or part of total cost which remains constant within short term irrespective of the changes in production quantity is known as fixed cost. As we know in marginal costing we have to segregate the total cost into two parts variable cost and fixed cost. Now what is the fixed cost or what is the say what part of total cost is fixed? The part or the cost which remains constant irrespective of changes in production quantity whether we increase the production quantity or decrease the production quantity this type of cost remains constant within short term. Say for example a particular fixed cost remains monthly fixed and if we produce 10,000 units in the month of January it is the same amount say 10,000 rupees or 10,000 dollars in February we produce only 8,000 units that means we have decreased the production quantity by 20 percent but there will be no change in this type of cost it will remain 10,000 rupees or 10,000 dollars so the nature of remaining constant irrespective of change in production quantity it is known as fixed cost but the name fixed cost is actually of the total amount of such type of cost that means the average amount of fixed cost per unit doesn't remain constant in January say in our example we had produced 10,000 units and the fixed cost was 10,000 rupees or dollars so the average amount comes to 1 rupee or 1 dollar per unit in February the cost was 10,000 but we produced 8,000 units so now in February the average amount of this fixed cost will be 10,000 rupees or dollars divided by 8,000 units so now it comes to 1.25 rupees or dollars per unit that means the average per unit amount of fixed cost doesn't remain constant but the total amount of fixed cost remain constant what are the examples rent depreciation local taxes and all such expenses which are based on time that means the amount of such cost is dependent on time and not dependent on the level or quantity of production if we present fixed cost through graph it can be something like this irrespective of change increase or decrease in production quantity there will be no change in the total amount of fixed cost it remains constant so the total fixed cost line is parallel to the x axis now what happens to the average amount of fixed cost if there is zero level of activity the fixed cost will be there it is not like the variable cost that remains zero at zero level of activity the fixed cost we have to incur the fixed cost irrespective of production quantity if we don't produce any unit during any month the fixed cost rather the monthly amounts of fixed cost we have to pay that means at zero level also it will be at its own place but as we increase the production quantity the same amount of total fixed cost is divided or distributed among more and more number of units so with increase in production quantity the average fixed cost per unit decreases within the short term so now we can say that the variable part or rather the variable cost is that part of total cost which varies according to the variation in production quantity in same direction 
while on the other hand the part of rather the remaining part of total cost which remains constant irrespective of increase or decrease in production quantity is known as fixed cost thank you very much